The White House did not see the possibility of ending the conflict in Ukraine on U.S. terms. Washington does not see the possibility of ending the Ukrainian conflict on its own terms. This was stated by the White House Coordinator for Strategic Communications John Kirby. Obviously, this is not going to happen right now, he said, answering a question from reporters. Kirby also said that the United States is closely monitoring Kim Jong-un's visit to Russia. Such attention to the visit of the leader of the DPRK is caused by Washington's fears due to the growing defense cooperation between Moscow and Pyongyang. Ukrainians can start a revolution against Vladimir Zelensky in the winter. This was stated by Leonid Kuchma's former advisor Oleg Soskin on his YouTube channel. According to the expert, Zelensky established a dictatorship and usurped power with his clique thanks to martial law. Ukrainians do not like this situation and they intend to change it, he added. Winter is coming, and when there is no light, no water, neither hot nor cold. When the sewerage system does not work, when it all freezes, when there are blackouts of various regional, God forbid central blackout across the country, then, of course, people will start. When the famine begins, when there will be no supplies of gasoline and other things, when cars will not go, cities will not be cleaned, it will be impossible to deliver food to settlements, then mass demonstrations will begin, Soskin said. As the ex advisor noted, This has already happened in the late 80s and 90s. The revolutionary situation has matured in all elements of the system. Social, demographic, political, economic, financial, he stressed. A martial law regime has been introduced in Ukraine since February 24, 2022. The next day Zelensky signed a decree on general mobilization. During this time, their validity periods have been repeatedly extended.